Greek celebration is underway in Tarpon Springs. It's called the Glendi, and it comes after a day filled with ceremony known as the Epiphany. Of course, the highlight of the day is the annual Diving for the Cross. News Channel 8's Peter Bernard watched it all happen, and he joins us now from Tarpon Springs. Peter, just a day full of celebration there. Wonderful day. Good evening, Jen. And this is where it all started at the Greek Orthodox Church. We're right in front of that statue that you see when you drive by. See, he's got the cross in his hand right there. And down the street, there's a festival with food, dancing, and music. And earlier this afternoon, the Epiphany Cross Dive. And it's an event that people plan for all year. More than 50 teenage boys leap into Spring Bayou for the annual Epiphany Cross Dive. They swam to board 10 dinghies roped together. At one point, so many tried to board one rowboat, it capsized. Thousands lined the banks of Spring Bayou to watch the spectacle, including the teen's parents. It's a tradition that's been going on for years and years, and just to see the kids, you know, the, the, now just you know, to keep celebrating, keep the tradition going, is, is great. As the archbishop threw the white wooden cross into the water, a frenzy of splashing began. Watch carefully as one diver goes underwater, and a few seconds later, he comes up with the cross. His name is Anderson Combs of Newport Ritchie and is a student at Hudson High. As is tradition, his fellow divers hoisted him high on their shoulders. Happy to be a part of the Orthodox Church and I, this is such a, such a miracle to have. I'm very blessed. This young Epiphany viewer believes she helped Anderson find the cross. I just pointed where it, where it do it and, and, he, and he got it. So you knew where it was? You saw it? And I got a cross for it. The church believes the one who retrieves the cross is blessed with a year of good luck. Got a message for your family today? Uh, I just want to thank them for all that they've done for me in my life, and I love them all. Compared to many previous Epiphany events, this one was fairly mild, but warm enough for a swim? When I first got in, it was a little cold, but once I realized that all my brothers were with me, it was a happy moment to be there, and I instantly warmed up. All right, and the church leaders stressed before the dive, just before the dive, that this is not an athletic event or a competition. This is a religious ceremony. However, that didn't keep the teens from trying their darndest. They really did. Jen? <laughs> they always do. Peter Bernard, live in Tarpon Springs for us. Thanks, yeah. Peter.